ending the double taxation yeah. of uh, Americans living abroad, uh, a proposal to make car loans interest tax deductible. That was, that was said. You said that in Detroit. Detroit. You even introduced this 15% corporate tax rate for companies who produce in America and hire American workers. But how will you pay for it? And the yeah. Committee for a Responsible yeah. Budget says your plans yeah. will increase the debt by $7.5 trillion. Yeah, but they don't know. They the don't Wall Street know. Journal said that your plans will increase the debt and deficits more than Kamala Harris's. If I do this, you're going to have car companies coming back to the country because of the taxes and the tariffs. The tariffs will protect them when they come in. So they will protect from other companies coming in because if the other companies don't come in, they're going to have to pay massive tariffs. And that said, so I was told, here's what was happening. Uh, China was building massive car plants, big car plants in Mexico. That's the new one. And I just spoke to the man that does it. He's a friend of mine. And I said, how's it going with Mexico? What's happening with the car plants? He said, sir, they've totally stopped. I said, why did they stop? Because they think you're going to be elected. And if you get elected, you know, I told them, I said, if I get elected, I'm going to put a 200% tariff on every car, and you're not going to ever sell them into the United States. I love because it. If they ever built those plants, Detroit is finished. South Carolina is finished. Everything's finished. So I said, here's what you're doing. They, they think they're going to go over there, build the biggest plants in the world in Mexico, right opposite us, and sell them in. Not going to happen. The auto workers are way down in the last 